Sounds good. All right. Yeah, we are in the kitchen with Chef Christopher Gross of Christopher's and Crush Lounge with a healthy dish. Now, I said we were making blackened sea bass. You decided to mix it up a little bit, and you bought black black and cod. Black cod, not black. Black and, cod. No. Okay. If we let you cook it, it might it be blackened. It would be blackened. <laughs> <laughs> so. what, what's going to be the difference in taste between the sea bass and the oh, they're, cod? They're both very mild fish. Okay. You would enjoy neither one of them. Really? <laughs> no, I'm like, no. am I going to like this? And I was like, going to bring some whipped eggs and bread it and so we could have fish sticks. Oh, they, I would have had that. Yeah, I know that. That would have been uh, perfect with this. But this is a you know wonderful, delicate fish. And what we're going to do, we're going to cook it in olive oil. We're going to slow cook it with tomatoes, um, all different kinds of vegetables. And then we can take these vegetables as well. And if you don't want to do the sea bass, we can make a nice salad out of it. Okay, perfect. So, so, now, when you say slow cook, what is your version of slow cook? Well, slow cook is like under 200 degrees. So we're, we have oil, okay. olive oil. And a you lot a of lot, olive oil. Lot. So what we're going to do is we're going to put a bunch of different vegetables in here, and you can use absolutely anything you want. The Sweet potatoes? Uh, carrots. Okay. So they, they I'm take, just going to stop right now. They take. Carrots uh, and? Uh, we have some turnips, French green beans, and some leeks. Okay. So carrots take a little bit longer to cook, so we just slow cook these on here, and we're going to add some a bay leaf, some tarragon. Mm -hmm. That'll give it a lot of nice flavor. And some garlic. So, one of the nice things about this, all these vegetables are going to slow cook in the olive oil and get a lot of flavor. And I put the carrots in first because they take a little okay. longer. Then we throw the rest of the vegetable in. Okay. So. And then, so 200, 200 for mm -hmm. how, how long do you think? This is going to take about an hour. Okay. So, once I bet it, it's going to smell really good uh, throughout it, the house. It, it smelled great. And then you'll have a little bit, you know, extra olive oil. Uh -huh. So you just pull some of that off and it'll make a nice vegetable vinaigrette for other things. Okay. So, and then we take the fish and we just, we can score it a little bit. And that's just going to help it cook it faster? It'll help cook or it just faster get the flavors and, and get in some there? of the flavor in there. And you can have it skin on, skin off, however you want it. And we would then place that in there. And we just cover it up and cook it. And then I forgot the coriander. Okay. Now the coriander's for? Flavor as well. Okay. And we're just going to dry roast that off here. Okay. So it'll develop the flavor, give a nice flavor, and then once it's roasted off, gets nice and hot, we'll crack that up and put that in there Oh, as I just well. got to... Oh, I'm smelling something really yummy over here. Probably all that garlic that you threw in there. Perfect. And you can put as much as you want. Right, definitely. Okay, so this is going to be a, um, a black cod, and then what are we making with it today? Well, with all the vegetables, that's a garnish, so mm -hmm. it's sort of a one-step dish. Okay. So we can make this really quick. You can cook the vegetables all up ahead of time, and then, you know, like 15, 20 minutes before cook, uh, you want to serve, we can just throw the black cod in or any kind of fish you want. Okay. If you want to speed this up, we could just simply take the fish and kind of butterfly it open like this. Right, so it cooks faster. So it'll cook much, much faster. So then you can be... And we're leaving the skin on. You can, or you can take it off. Okay. Totally What's the purpose here. of leaving it on? Well, it tastes good. Oh, you eat it with it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Everyone? Yeah. 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 I should have breaded it for you. Okay, so I wouldn't <laughs> have seen the skin, huh? Yes. <laughs> okay, well, when we come back, what, how are we going to sort of work on this when we come back? What's when we come step? back, the fish will be cooked. Okay. And then we'll range it on the plate with the vegetables. We still have to add the tomatoes and crush the coriander to put inside. Okay, so, so we're going to finish it up and then try it. Uh-huh, you're going to try it. I think I'll try it. Okay. It smells really good.